Hey, welcome back, explorers, to Starbound, the Fracking Universe mod. And today, we're going to be going on an epic journey. We are going to be facing off against Mama Pop Top. You heard it right. We are on our way to her dungeon, and we are going to take that beautiful beastie out. But first, get some blades, son. Oh, oh, look at you. I'm taking a little bit more damage than what I wanted to, but uh, hey, hey, it's okay. It's all right. I got it. I got it. Hey, yep, you stay over there. I didn't miss, by the way. That was an intimidation swing. I was putting them in their place. Ha, ah, look at you. All right, you know, uh, I really need to be more mindful of the, you know, as I say that, I freaking take fall damage. You know, fall damage is the thing that's going to kill me the most in this series. And we have ascended into the depths of the Mama Pop Top dungeon. Uh, you know, I can't stop saying enough good things about this dungeon you know because the crew or the or the group or single person i'm not exactly sure but the mind behind fracking universe has done an amazing job with this place i mean this is one of my most favorite places to be there are other awesome and cool things that they have done but the mama pop top dungeon is iconic it's the first the first creature you face off against the starbound shut up stomach I'm trying to speak here and praise the great creators of fracking universe as i often do but hey you know what let's 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 try this bow out on this guy down here real fast look at that uh, sidetracked already we'll, we'll we'll kill thingy and then i'll i'll talk about it and then i'll forget it and then talk about something else you know you know you know how it goes i said you know a lot right there wow this bow is really not <laughs> yo oh bullets will make it rain on these guys oh that was beautiful that was that was perfect ah uh, you know let's go ahead take care of this hunger thing here because i believe and i could be wrong hunger and energy tied together maybe i don't know but we're gonna eat anyway ah uh, give me this loot all kinds of little things and i think it's a heart or something yeah i'm pretty sure that was a heart all right bomb to the door we're gonna get in here and grab this treasure chest and see what is up uh eh. well maybe you know there was some buff food in there yeah, that's something i need to like focus on in the future is buff food i uh, hardly ever you, you don't you uh, you did it anyway you're not supposed to smack me you're supposed to get smacked by me and look at that one of the great things about coming into this dungeon and forming it, you know, is the food. You just get tons of food for free. And later on, we're going to head up to a spot that has a place to cook it. So you could boil your rice and your pear peas and pearl peas, pear peas. I don't really know what they're called, to be honest. But uh, can I not can I not say enough good things about the hotkey loot all mod? Freaking fabulous geniusness. I need to put that in the mod description below and really point people towards this mod because it is phenomenal in every way i mean oh being able to tap a button and get oh come here oh oh we got some baddies all kinds of them oh you guys ain't nothing take my blade oh, oh. oh this little dude over here and i believe we have a successfully successfully made it halfway through the dungeon these guys and they're freaking whistling uh they're little happy tunes man i gotta oh, it's so uh it just Killing them makes me happy because they just walk around whistling like like nothing. But this sword, though, that combo swing, right? I mean, it's... I don't know if I said this before, but I'm using the aimable broadswords mod. And I feel like... Mm, did you see that? That smack right there? Oh, that downward spike right into his brain cage. Beautiful. And But, oh, yeah. But see? Right here. This is where you can cook your stuff. And I already, already lost my train of thought. But let's get back on it. I remembered it now. Yeah, aimable weapons should be a, a base game thing because I don't know. With the way Starbound combat work, you really need to be able to aim. And yeah, I just remembered that I forgot these barrels down here. And look at that, I have some iron in there. That's that's good fun. Pixels. Oh, easy now. Oh, whoa, you mother trucker. Yeah. I wasn't expecting that to do so much damage. Oh, got you up there. Oh, you stuck. Look at you. Mm, yes. Well, maybe that's the situation right there. Why well, they don't do aimable melee weapons? Cause derpiness happens with the baddies, and then you just kill to file them like like super ease. Ah, uh, speaking. Huh? Lost train of thought again. 
But that's alright, we're gonna go up here and we're gonna bomb this door. Oh, by the way, what do you guys think about the Mama Pop Pop Donkey? You know, the fracking universe version of it. Ooh, that was loud. Let me know in the comments below, what do you guys think about this place? I love it, and I can't say enough great things about it, but I, I praise the mod developers all the time. And another thing that I'm really excited for is Shell Guard. I really can't wait to get into that. That's not something that I've really had a lot of, you know, experience with. I've not, I've actually, I don't even know if I've done anything with Shell Guard, but it's it's something that Starbound recommends. It's really a really really cool add-on. There's a lot of content in there, and speaking of a lot of content, Project Nightfall is another mod that I'm thinking about putting into it. So we'd be we'd be a fracking guard fall kind of pack. I don't, I don't know. I'm not brain is not coming up with cool things right now to say about all that but i mean shell guard can't wait to touch it you know play with it and, and figure out what it all ooh, loud again we got one more loud thing maybe in the edit future me will be like hey this part was loud let me fix it with some clever you know thingies and shield i don't know why i enjoy doing that but i just stand there and it's so cool to I don't I'm weird. I'm weird. Look at that. The Avali with the jump. Already a good ar arrow. Ar blah blah. Aerobatic race. Oh, dang it. But with that, that slightly boosted jump, man, we really get some super good height there. I mean, look at that. We can almost go up to two of those platforms. That was really good. And slow fall. And now we're going to get rid of slow fall because the, the Avali racial ability is considered tech right it takes up a tech slot which i uh, i wish that there was a way to give it give racial abilities their own tech slot right i mean i'm sure that's probably extremely effing difficulty but you know i'm not i'm not a programmer right? i don't do all that i i just have wishful thinking and wish these things would come true but anyway let's get down here uh come on now get son of a mother trucker just get I just, what the, I feel like, uh, oh, oh, well, I'm dumb. <laughs> Could have been doing that the whole time. That's so, that's just genius of me right there. Uh, but yeah, like I was saying, you know, I'm just, I'm just wishful thinking on things because, but when I think about it, well, no, because it wouldn't be broken or overpowered because, I mean, how mm -hmm. often do you really turn into a ball I mean, in the, in the grand spectrum of the game there are very few instances where you turn into the ball sure there's areas and little events that you can go through but, but like me personally i spend the majority of my time in the outer world so to speak huh some goodies here these goodies might be worth keeping pistoli pretty good yeah okay that one yeah uh i think we got our new uh our new dual pistol set up here i'm not I've not really settled on weapons just you know and what I want to keep around pretty sure I'm gonna have a one-handed and, and a shield that's a thing some kind of ranged weapon and probably a heavy melee weapon of some kind but I don't know exactly what all those things are gonna fall into speaking of all that you know I really need to get into the habit of when I farm this place to collect the ancient essence see half the time i don't even do it i mean I, I i literally think i just left some up there on the ground and i need to like not do that but let's let's get some sword action in here i got a bat bro coming up behind me that's okay though but this this poor little old rapier i mean it's it's really good it was a really good early find and i was super happy that i cut the rapier because they are themselves really good but nothing beats old faithful here look at that uh i missed the, i missed the stroke but i got them for you <laughs> that was that was completely wasted right there but it was it was it was cool though it was fun to use and the fact that i can aim this thing would be is is great the only problem is that i don't really aim it all that easy now i don't aim it all that well now these boxes here fingers crossed fingers crossed let's nope and nope and no but Manipulator module, matter, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, so 
that was good but usually this is where i've i've been finding the uh teleporter cores more often but the thing about those teleporter cores is it's very rare to find them in here i don't know if i mentioned this before but you can get teleporter cores from uh mom popped up here and that is something that can jump start your item transfer network with fracking universe but Wee's getting close to the boss <laughs> sebastian why don't you pop that boss music for us bro man it is time to get that battle on where's she at hey darling what you doing over there girl let me just handle this business up here and i'll be right with you don't worry i got a couple things to say to the oh he died for i got to say him i got something special for you i've been saving this for a while I'm gonna make it rain darling 180s right there oh nothing says a good boss battle like fire all over his face huh and a couple little pistol bullets and we's done not too bad not too bad having that platform there and being able to whoa easy now being able to uh get above her keep her down there makes it pretty simple but i mean you don't have to fight her like that you can fight her normally but i mean i'm gonna i'm gonna pick easy when it comes to my pop top she, she don't play around she don't play jokes on you now there's a lot of things like right there to my left see that that is a treasure chest or possibly just there to look cool but there's like little secrets in here because i know there's a way i've seen little statues holding stuff so there's ways to get to different things possibly with different text i know there's a little miniature ball and speaking of uh speaking of that tech let's uh let's 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 switch over to some slow foliage here and uh that might be able to increase her chance getting over there to where we need to be all right all right he does it and bam oh perfect oh wait whoa wait a minute i didn't work out like i thought it was going to and yeah <laughs> okay maybe slow fall was not the right answer for that particular situation so we'll we'll skip off of that and that that's the perfect one right there but now that we're up here we got to switch tech back around and you know in a lot of these situations uh yeah i mean i guess it's not bad i mean it doesn't take a whole lot of effort to really change the tech around so yeah I, I, it's good it's good i didn't get really it, you know get what i need out of there so let's go well i was supposed to not do that but i did it anyway uh yeah let's get out of here wait a minute did i forget a treasure chest i think i totally forgot one there's one to the far right i can't remember if i got it or not uh, well it's, it's not like i'm not going back you know i'm gonna be there there's many many things that i must pick up from that beautiful place all right we have a couple things that we need to do in here wouldn't i don't know yeah mostly is right here hopefully after we sell all of this stuff here that we don't really need we're going to be able to pick up pick up what we're here for the whole reason of defeating mama pop top and get to the outpost is the garden bots the lumberjack the miner the guard the actual gardening one that's that's the whole reason we're here and i think i think we're gonna be good we may not be able to get a whole lot and what's whoa eye patch where did you come from i don't even remember getting you or do i i don't i don't know but that's awesome all right let's grab a few things that we need here yep yeah, man maybe a couple more uh yeah let's go with go to gonna need to grab some uh what are they called Oh, uh, oh! Completely forgot. We're just gonna grab everything here that we need, and I think, I think, that, I think that's good. I think that's good. Yeah. Like I said, this is. God dang it! This is the whole reason we've come here is to pick this stuff up, and most importantly, it's right here. We're gonna snatch up. We're gonna bookmark this teleshop, and this is gonna let us pop back and forth. I don't think. I think one of my mods that I'm using, probably garden might be setting it up so the Kellis shop Ursa and whatchamacallit can be act can be accessed before the uh Urtuous mining facility so there is that if you guys are you know watching uh my series here and you're like oh wait a minute that something might be off here 
I don't know though. That might be a fracking universe thing. I'm not 100% sure, but just in case, that that's that's what that is. By the way, it's probably probably a thing that's doing that. So, yeah, yeah. Just just, just overlook it. It's a little, little overpowered, but it, it, it's fine. It's fine. It's it's okay. We've we've played, and look at this guy. He's gonna derp out, guaranteed. Watch him. Yeah, he derp. Derp. That's the one thing about these mining bots, man. They 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 derp out a lot. I love them to death, though. Uh, and I, I'm totally, would totally never not play without this mod. But yeah, they they, they get all derp delicious. So we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna set up. We're gonna set up Lumber Bros place here. And yeah, 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 yep. Yeah. Successful times today, guys. I mean, oh, I have so much farming to do for the moment popped up off camera. And whoa, I didn't even see that. You mother trucker, come here. I will blow you away with stabs somehow. <laughs> you just, you, you, yeah, that was it's exactly how you needed to go out. Coming up, I, that startled me a little bit, ain't gonna lie. I, I jumped just a little bit, just a little bit. All right, but this, this guy right here is gonna be the one that we're always going to be using. He will be at every primary installation that we have and maybe maybe two of them maybe we'll give him a buddy to hang out with or yeah we also need some defender bots for some of the some of the see that one didn't derp that one didn't derp at all other guy over there he's gonna teleport up here and probably tear down half of her base but yeah i don't know the ne well oh see he came back up or was that or was that or was that the one they were both similar colors can't remember which is which I don't know okay. well anyway let's let's set up our gardening bots here because i definitely want i definitely want a corn going because i need that i need that constantly going uh, and you know like i've said before that's that's our entire income of oil so let me oh yeah i forgot you can't set oh look at that guy over there he's just chopping away over there chopping away all right we need to uh we need to pop this up here so we can set old dude bro down here that way he can get going. Wait a minute. I bought the yeah, I bought the right one. Oh, I didn't. I didn't buy the cool ones. Dang it. Oh. Mother trucker. I'll have to fix that. The cool ones have a little sprinkler on the top, by the way, and they spin around. Alright. Alright, now he's going back. He's going back. We just gotta trap him in. Come on now. Come on. Killing me here. Killing me here. You're dragging the episode on. People don't want to watch you creep along now. They want to. They want to see things being done. They want to see progress. All right, perfect. Now we can go up here. I think Weeder Cotton. I don't know what. You son of a. Huh? How did you get out? Maybe he was like. Maybe I don't know. We got. We got. We got to fix this. We got to fix this. Let's. Uh, let's make a. Uh, what is it? Ten string for a bug net. Yeah. Now, by the way, the bug net is what you use to kind of like uh, to kind of pick these guys up so you can replace them down you don't want to you don't want to destroy them with with like weapons or anything like that or you can't really like click on and pick them up because they're like a weird little entity right now so bug net it is because if we was to hit them with a weapon or something like we could destroy them i can't remember if that's happened before or if i lost stuff hmm you know it's probably a case of me just losing stuff now, the cool thing, cool thing about these little garden bots is they also till and wa and water your the ground. So they just once you set them down, they just go. And it's freaking awesome. Now later on, we're gonna have a much better system with the fracking universe stuff, the uh, hydroponics bays, the all the growing bays and things like that. So uh, that is gonna set us up completely. But with that being said, I think. This is going to be a perfect spot to call the episode. So as always, my friends, when in doubt, crowbar out.